team. So we've gone through sleeping gear. Now we're gonna move on to important clothing that you need to bring. So when we think about sort of shirts that we wanna wear, we generally wanna stay away from cotton because if it rains, it's gonna hold all that water and keep you cold. What we like to see is sort of lightweight, quick dry shirts like this, long sleeve preferably to keep you protected from the sun. And if you have a collar on your shirt, shirt too, that's great because you can pop that up and that will protect your neck, okay? With shorts and pants, uh, we like sort of quick, dry, lightweight pants, sort of like these ones I'm wearing right now. We don't really want to see long trackies because they are quite uncomfortable to walk in. Uh, when we think about jumpers, um, I, you can see we've got this lovely black diamond jumper here, but the only issue with this is one, it's really heavy and it's going to be very hard to compress down and fit in your pack, okay? So some alternatives you can use is some fleeces like this, super lightweight, and you can squish that into your pack very easily. Or even better is a nice puffer jacket, a nice down puffer jacket. You can squish that up, compress that down, and that will also fit nicely into your pack and keep you really, really warm. Another piece of equipment which we can never ever forget regardless of the forecast is a good rain jacket. We never know when it's gonna rain and it's the worst when you're out on a hike or on the water and it gets rainy and you're soaking wet there. So we wanna remember that rain jacket too. Um, another important thing, I'm wearing it right on my head now, this beautiful hat. Wide brim hat is perfect. That's gonna protect the front and the back of your face. Um, if you don't have one of those, caps can work really well too, but we need to make sure that we have a hat with us. And when we think about shoes, I don't really wanna see any like work boots like this, super heavy. They're not very comfortable to hike in. We don't wanna see that. We'd rather like a good pair of sturdy hiking boots, well worn in, wear them a couple of times, walk around the block a few times, you need to make sure they're well worn in just like these. Or if you don't have hiking boots, a good pair of trainers too will do the trick as well. You just got to make sure that they're well worn in because if they're not, you'll probably get blisters and that will make it really uncomfortable for you. Sweet.